terrifying. It looks scary. <laughs> I can see the idea of a climate change here. Freddy Krueger. I have a couple of traditions on my channel and one of the traditions is that every year during Halloween month I'm making some dark, creepy videos. I mean, painting on clothes videos. I'm creating some dark designs on clothes. But this year something went wrong, you know, some personal issues, then some custom orders, and I just couldn't make it on time. I just couldn't make any dark video this month. And actually, you know, I feel sad a bit because I love to create creepy designs, I just love it. But then I thought that maybe it's for good, because instead of just making one dark clothes customization video, I can use this gap as an opportunity to show you a bunch of amazing, terrifying, scary, mind-blowing designs of very talented clothes customizers. And if you love creepy designs, if you love horror movies, this video will be a pure joy for you. So without further ado, let's get started. By the way, I'm Daria and welcome back to our fashion channel. I made five folders with five different types of designs and first folder name is horror movies designs inspired by horror movies do you love horror movies and if you love what would you love to be painted on your denim jacket for example maybe some character maybe some ghosts maybe demons i don't know <laughs> you know i love haunted houses horror movies like i just love this concept of family moving in some abandoned house and then there are all kind of things happening. So I would love to paint something inspired by haunted house movies. Well, and I have a very, very talented clothes customizer here. Um, here I will put Instagram account of the clothes customizer. So you can follow this clothes customizer and just show your support. The Instagram name of the first clothes customizer is Je Draw. And here is the first jacket. It's a Voldemort, Harry Potter inspired Voldemort uh, portrait denim jacket. And as you can see, definitely Clothes Customizer is very talented. I mean, just artistic skills is just on another level. And I just love how he played with this green color. I mean, not only he made kind of this smoke with the skull, but also you can see shoulders are green and you can see two little spikes there. <laughs> Such a little small detail, but very important detail. Because clothes customization is all about details. Like when you can notice such details and you can say, wow, it's there for a reason. <laughs> so I just love how this jacket turned out. And even buttons on the jacket are green. I don't know, did he paint them or... I think yeah, he painted them green. So it looks very, very interesting. <laughs> and next jacket is Dracula jacket, uh, again by Jed Rowe. Uh, well, I said horror movies inspired, but what I'm showing you is definitely not the horror movies, but we'll get to them. So this Dracula jacket is also mind blowing. It's so cool. And this clothes customizer, not only like his artistic skills are so high, but he also knows how to use canvas what to do with canvas for your artwork to look cool how to prepare canvas for customizing so just by dyeing jacket red distressing it and also there are spikes on the shoulders he created the whole vibe for this dracula like the artwork is so great of course but if this dracula were painted on some simple blue denim jacket it wouldn't have such wow effect you know this jacket but the canvas is so important, so keep it in mind if you want to create very interesting eye-catching customization. Think what you can do with your canvas, I mean with your jacket or t-shirt, you can dye it, you can bleach it, you can distress it, you can add some patches. There are a lot of possibilities to create a cool eye-catching customization. Here you can see three jackets by Jedro. Uh, what is the name of this scary nun? I don't remember. Uh, but this jacket is also probably it's uh, no it's a denim jacket not a leather jacket or maybe it's leather i'm not sure but it also looks so cool and next jacket is a uh, beetlejuice inspired jacket and again 
like the jacket, the color of the jacket creates a vibe and such a funky vibe. And uh, I don't know, did he buy such yellow jacket or did he dye it? But I love that it's yellow. And yeah, the artwork, of course, is very interesting. There is also details on the front side. And I love when a designer, clothes customizer, adds some details to the front side as well to support, you know, the idea, to make uh, the idea more clear, like the idea of the customization. So here, as you can see, also some little small details on the front side. So when you want to customize the denim jacket, see it as the whole piece, you know, with the back side, with the front side, with the sleeves. You can use sleeves for customization. You can use color. You can place your artwork like wherever you want. Don't limit yourself thinking that you can place your artwork only on the back side of your denim jacket. And next denim jacket is a Venom denim jacket and it's also mind-blowing. And again, you see the canvas is prepared. <laughs> I mean, he dyed denim jacket. Sleeves are purple. Um, and yeah, the artwork is so cool. I mean, the level of it is so high. The Venom looks so creepy, probably because of the teeth. Uh, artists made them so yellow and also yellow background. Yeah, the artwork is definitely so cool. And you know, I guess I know the secret of the cool customization, especially if you want to create some creepy design. So the bigger you make it, the better. Like the bigger your design, the more eye-catching it will be. Because you see artists use the whole space the whole backside to create such a huge venom. Venom just screaming that I'm here, look at me, <laughs> and I'm so cool. And yeah, the jacket is so cool as well. Well, this is pretty all the jackets which I wanted to show you from this clothes customizer. But this clothes customizer has a lot of interesting customization on his Instagram account. So feel free to follow him, show him some love. And uh, let's uh, move to the horror movie designs, as I promised you. Uh, first, I want to show you IT customization, IT movie inspired customization. And here artist, I guess that artist bleached t-shirt, I mean these paint splashes are actually a uh, bleach splashes, but I'm not sure, but probably it's a paint splashes, but you can create such effect using bleach as well. The portrait of this character on the front side and also there's a back side. <laughs> it's the same t-shirt, front side and back side. And again, paint on the t-shirts, again, you can use front side and back side as well. Don't think that your design can be placed only on the front side. When there is a, an artwork on the front side, on the back side, of course, it's much more interesting. So the character is on the front side and then this boy and balloon uh, on the back side. Yeah, and there is Ono, oh Russian it, <laughs> written on the t-shirt. And I want to show you one more it customization. It's a baseball cap. Here definitely it's a paint splashes. It's a blood, <laughs> blood splashes. Uh, then the portrait of the character, then the hello on this part of the cap. Don't know the name of it. Yeah, it looks pretty cool and again, very eye-catching because <laughs> the artwork just big. So yeah. Very creepy baseball cap. And I have one more. Mm, I have one more. Yeah, I have one more. A customization, it customization. Yeah, here's just the front side of the t-shirt painted, but it lo also looks very interesting, very cool. And one more it customization. <laughs> I guess that clothes customizers love uh, this movie and I also created it customization. I have a video on my channel and if you haven't seen it yet, please watch it. It's one of my favorite videos on my channel. Oshka. Let me show you my little, little boy. He came to say hello. Let's get back to the horror movies. Here is again this 
character, I don't remember the name of it, this nun <laughs> customization. And again, I guess it's a bleach splashes. It's the same artist which created it customization front side and back side. I don't know, um, does this t-shirt uh, have a back side customization, but I found just image of the front side, but yeah, the, it looks scary. <laughs> it looks very scary. And uh, here is Freddy Krueger, or how do you call him? We call it in Russia Freddy Krueger. Again, the artist first prepared the canvas because there is a bleach background, these stripes. Artist made stripes using bleach and then the artwork on top of this um, bleached background. And again, the level of artwork is so high and I just love this customization. It has this creepy vibe, it has the character, it has the idea, it has the composition. Yeah, this customization has pretty everything you need for cool customization. And one more baseball cap, it's an alien baseball cap. Again, it's so cool customization. Here you can see a space background, then the back side is painted in character and the front side is painted this alien. Very detailed customization, even though it's a small baseball cap, artist spent a lot of time on this cap and yeah it's a lot of time a lot of effort but the result is as you can see so cool and now let me show you shoes um, i know that many of you would love to see me painting shoes but i'm just not a shoes customizer i just don't like uh, to paint on such small areas because as you can understand i love to create huge customization the bigger the better so yeah but i know that there are a lot of amazing talented shoes customizers out there and actually shoes customization is much more popular much much more popular than clothes customization so here is a scream customization very creative very interesting logo is bleeding uh, then there's a this character <laughs> a creepy character yeah it's very cool customization on the shoes and here is the a nightmare before Christmas customization and again I'm not sure about this gradient maybe Probably, yeah, the artist created this gradient because I can see pink paint on the background. So probably this is the, the artist created such beautiful um, gradient and I love it. And also, yeah, the artwork is so beautiful. I love this shine which artist created. Yeah, it's interesting, beautiful, cool customization on the Vans shoes. Okay, let's move to the next folder. It's a... Uh, demons i have very demonic customization here demons some demonic creatures very very creepy creatures so first i want to show you denim vest and it's a japanese uh, mask creature from the japanese mythology um i guess the name of it is what is the name of it yeah oni i guess it's oni well, uh, it's a pretty popular design among clothes customizer because as you can see, this mask definitely <laughs> has a character. If you want to create such creepy design, uh, dark design, you can definitely use J Japanese mythology and characters from Japanese mythology, uh, such masks, demonic masks. Next, uh, customization on the buttons up shirt, the back side of the shirt, and uh, it's uh, also demon, <laughs> very scary. And I guess that um, the artist used airbrush. I think it looks like an airbrush. Uh, I need to buy compressor, then I will be able to use airbrush, which I have actually. Yeah, here I, I see it, airbrush kit, but I just don't have a compressor. So probably, I hope that one day I will create a video uh, with uh, showing you how to airbrush on t-shirts or other clothes. And here you can see airbrushing technique. Yeah, again, you see the artwork is huge. <laughs> so it's so interesting, so it's so eye-catching. Uh, next is a leather jacket with a demonic design. There's a demon, then some dog, and yeah, such a chaos, a bit of chaos on the leather jacket. And by the way, this brand, Punk and Saint, it's a very cool brand. I mean, they use...
they use um, thrifted clothes uh, for customization only vintage such vintage thrifted clothes and so they have very interesting pieces and this denim jacket is also vintage denim jacket and yeah they customize the back side of it looks cool and one more t-shirt by the same brand punk and saint and it's a demon painted with bleach yeah here you can see artists used only bleach for customization only bleach nothing more and if you think how is it possible <laughs> you can watch a video on my channel where i used only bleach for customization i show there how to do it it's pretty simple and the result is so cool so yeah, it's also a demon design. And one more jacket by the same brand, Punk and Saint. I love this brand. I love their style and also I love that they use vintage clothes. So yeah, it's also vintage leather jacket and simple, pretty simple customization. I mean, just simple graphic uh, demon, then some lettering, but it looks so interesting, so cool. And one more demon customization. This demon is painted on the some kind of a coat, maybe a raincoat. Yeah, you can paint on raincoats as well, but you need to find the right paints for such kind of clothes. Um, for example, I customized puffer jacket. I have a video on my channel. I used Pebeo fabric paints, which I guess you can use on such raincoat as well. So yeah, again, the artwork is so big. So yeah, it's pretty eye-catching and it's so creepy. And next one is such creepy dogs design, getting out of the darkness. Yeah, this effect that there is a darkness and just eyes and teeth. And yeah, this effect is so interesting, so cool. And it makes design so creepy. And yeah, also that there is an artwork on the hood yeah i love that artists decided to create such fire on the hood it definitely makes customization much more interesting such interesting detail well one more customization i have here and i just love it here you can see there is a slogan on this hoodie i guess it's a hoodie i'm your bad news and i think that artists bought the hoodie with the slogan with a printed slogan on it because this slogan looks so clean, I guess it's a print. I think, I'm not sure, but I think that it's a print. And then the artist created the whole idea around this slogan, I'm your bad news. There's this story on this hoodie, not just an artwork, it's a whole story. There's a girl, there is this demonic creature trying to, don't know what's trying to do with this girl, but it looks so scary and yeah i love to create stories myself and that is the way you can create customization of another level you know when you're not only making some artwork but when you're creating a whole story with an idea with the meaning and also of course the level of the artwork is so high and yeah just just one just my favorite customization of this folder demons folder well i guess it's pretty all the demons a design I want to show you and next folder is uh, skulls folder I love to paint skulls on clothes and you can create very creepy very dark designs with skulls and first sweatshirt I want to show you by this cool brand punk and saint and I just love this sweatshirt I mean so simple design but I can see here so deep idea and yeah the idea is so cool at least I can see it here I'm not sure that that is the idea <laughs> but I can clearly see it here so that is the North Face sweatshirt and a sweatshirt was bleached so you can see such kind of a lava cracks or some heat effect on it and then there is a skull and the skull is saying we deserve it i can see the idea of a climate change here you know <laughs> that yeah we are guilty we deserve it we are guilty that that is happening with our planet that temperatures are rising so yeah if this was the idea of this sweatshirt i just want to say bravo and yeah, making it so simple but at the same time so cool and so deep and so meaningful yeah it's um, it's a talent i can say so yeah as you can see there is no rule that you should create such a very complicated customization to make it look cool no you can create very simple customization but again it will look very cool 
So again, brand pumpkin saying in this video I show you a lot of uh, customization of this brand because yeah, they have really cool customization. Uh, and if you are a beginner especially, you can take it as an inspiration because designs which they make are pretty simple. Like any beginner can create something like that. And as you can see, pretty cool customization they make. One Moscow customization on a vest. Um, it's not an airbrush, uh, but uh, brush. They use brush and fabric paints. And I love it. It looks creepy, it looks cool, it looks interesting, and again, the skull is huge. <laughs> the slogan of this video is the bigger, the better. Yeah. And next one is artist. It's actually an artist who uh, paints on canvases. Here you can see on this picture uh, art on the canvas and art on the denim jacket. So yeah, this artist, he uh, is a canvas artist. He paints mostly on canvases, but then he decided to try to paint on denim jacket. And as you can see, the result is so cool. Like, I love this style. I love the colors. Yeah, it's pretty unique. It looks very interesting, this denim jacket. Like, it looks even better than this canvas, <laughs> in my opinion. You know, I wish that clothes customization be treated as an art, actually. And maybe one day we will see customized clothes in art galleries. Why not? <laughs> it would be so cool. And one more and last uh, artwork in this folder. It's a customization on a um, bag. Of course, it's professionally made customization made by a professional artist. And yeah, it's so cool. And actually painting on leather is so easy, like in comparison with denim jacket, for example. It's so hard to paint on a rough denim fabric, but it's so easy to paint on a smooth leather fabric. So if you are a beginner, if you like feel scared, you're afraid to paint on denim, you're afraid that you won't be able to apply paint to create smooth transitions on denim, you can try to paint on leather first because yeah, it's so easy. Like, I'm just really enjoying uh, leather customization. I'm just feeling that I'm resting in the process of painting because yeah, it's just so smooth, so easy to apply paint and you can create so detailed artwork on the leather. Even such small, you know, customized bag can be the star of your outfit. It will be able to change your outfit completely from boring to so cool. <laughs> Well, this is all in this folder, folder skulls. And next folder is snakes. Snakes are my favorite animals to paint on clothes because you can create so interesting composition with snakes. You can place them on the sleeves, on the legs. <laughs> so yeah, here is um, the first um, customization which I want to show you. It's so cool. Yeah, the design actually is pretty simple. Just two graphic snakes. But the way the artist placed them, just this makes this customization so interesting and so cool. I saw eye catching. And next snake customization is snake on pants and again, simple graphic snake like even a beginner can make and paint such simple graphic snake but again the way the artist placed it and made it such a big <laughs> again big snake make this customization look so cool so interesting and this is my favorite snake customization of this folder because let me explain you because there is a story you know this sweatshirt i guess it's a merch sweatshirt of some grocery store um it's, it's i guess it's a german grocery store uh, because i can read here wir sind die guten makromarkt i'm kind of trying to learn german now <laughs> so i guess it's a german grocery store merchandise and then the artist used this absolutely simple absolutely like cheap i guess sweatshirt and turn it into something so 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 cool like this custom gesture for me shows the possibilities that you can take some simple cheap merchandise of some grocery store like you don't have to use expensive clothes you don't have to spend thousands and thousands of dollars on luxury clothes you can Take such simple merchandise and 
create it into something which you won't be able to buy like anywhere. It's unique, it's handmade, it has vibe, it has energy and it's just one of a kind. And this is pretty all you need to know about clothes customization that is cool <laughs> and you have a power. When you know how to customize your clothes, you have a superpower to create a unique, absolutely unique clothes. You know guys, after making this video, I decided to follow this customizer who created a snake sweatshirt, follow and see if there are any other information about this sweatshirt, <laughs> because I found it very interesting, you know, some German store merchandise sweatshirt and then the artwork on it. And I found the information that actually this sweatshirt is a pretty old piece. It's a vintage sweatshirt. It's a 30 years old sweatshirt. And the owner of it got it from that. And the owner of it actually gave it to customizer to save it because sweatshirt was in bad condition. There were stains and customizer not only saved it, but turned it into a piece of art. And now this sweatshirt has a new life. Sustainability, uniqueness. And next folder is just some random artworks, dark uh, or creepy artworks, which I liked, but I just couldn't name them to create a folder. So the first one is a Dracula shirt. Again, <laughs> the bigger the better. The Dracula is so big. And uh, there's also a back side of this shirt. No, the front side, sorry. So the front side, just a shadow of uh, Dracula and the back side is uh, Dracula himself and yeah the idea is so interesting and it's also very eye-catching very interesting customization and um, next one is artwork on a denim jacket and I guess it's an original artwork of this clothes customizer I hope so because this is so cool and the level of it is so crazy so detailed yeah and i remember somebody said that it's a denim jacket like you can't create a, a detailed artwork on a clothes like look at it like look how detailed this artwork is like there is no difference between painting on canvas painting on denim jacket you can create the same level of artwork so yeah that is so cool. <laughs> and the next one, brand of this video, Punk and Saint, and probably it's uh, some anime design, I'm not sure, maybe some anime character. I'm not a fan of an anime, so I'm not sure. But again, uh, airbrush used and artist um, made it so sloppy, you know. He didn't try to make it very detailed. He didn't try to make it very kind of a professionally made, but that is a vibe to make it such a sloppy way. <laughs> and um, a next one, again, I guess it's an anime character. I'm not sure again, but again, the size of it is big. There's an energy you can feel. And yeah, it's just so cool. And one more and last one is, it's not very creepy, scary design, but I just love it. I don't know. <laughs> and you can see in this design close customization techniques that you can create such abstract background, you can create paint splashes, you can use outliner to create lines, uh, draw some lines and yeah, the more techniques you use, the more unique your artwork will be on clothes. Uh, some people say that like, why would you like paint your clothes? You can buy printed clothes, they're cheap, there are so many different prints out there. But for me, painting on clothes is a kind of a fighting, a printing machine, because printing machine is not able to make even half of what you are able to do. Different techniques, different effects, like even size, like printing machines sometimes is not able to create such a big size uh, prints and you can do it. You can use the whole space of your, of the backside of your denim jacket. You can use all the areas of your baseball cap and you can create so beautiful effects on your clothes, which printing machine just not able to make. So yeah, it's about uniqueness. It's about making something which you can't find anywhere. So well guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was probably the creepiest, the darkest video on my channel. But yeah, it's a Halloween month. <laughs> so happy Halloween and I hope to see you next time. Fashion is art. Bye bye.